Hello and welcome to the Mastering Clean Code in JavaScript course by Pact Publishing. I am Dimitris Lukas and I will be guiding you through the journey of making JavaScript code cleaner, more maintainable and above all, more expressive and easier to read and reason with. In this video I will present you the course material and everything you need to know to prepare for future videos. We will begin this course with general tips on how to better structure your code and how to create clean functions. We will then add functional programming skills to our toolbox. Functional programming can be extremely valuable on certain use cases. Moving on, we will study all the module definitions and module loaders that may have you wondering right now. After that, we will go back to the traditional way and study design patterns and principles that can prove to be particularly valuable with enterprise apps. We will later get a taste of unit testing and we will finish this course by exploring error handling in JavaScript applications. Before you begin this course, you must have some prior programming experience in JavaScript. This isn't a course for complete JavaScript beginners. You should also have some experience with object-oriented programming as this course dives deep into OOP concepts in the fourth section. Some knowledge of functional programming could also be proven helpful, but not necessary. Finally, it would be really nice, although optional, to have experience with full stack JavaScript. This course will use examples both on the server with Node.js and the client. However, no special framework will be used, so no Angular, React or Vue.js, just plain JavaScript. Let's have a look at what you need to set up in order to make the most out of this course. You could use any operating system, this course is on Windows, but it really doesn't make any difference. A good code editor is also important. This course uses Visual Studio Code, but that's up to you. You should have Node.js installed on your machine. This course was made on top of Node.js version 8.9.1, and you are also advised to globally install Webpack on your machine for the front-end examples. After finishing this course, you will be able to write better and cleaner JavaScript code and modules will no longer confuse you. You will have learned strong skills regarding both functional and object-oriented JavaScript. You will also learn how unit testing works and how to set up top-notch error handling in your applications. The course will focus on the concepts and principles, so the examples will be kept simple. However, you will be able to apply what you learn to a great variety of projects from small ones to large-scale enterprise applications.